with artists is they can't keep the light on. They can't keep the conversation going on. Now, sure, true enough, they got to stay doing what they doing, but I want to have our own playlist, our own top 10. You know what I'm saying? So when people get placed up there, um, you know, who whatever room is our virtual audience that day and our guests come in and present their music, right? I want that room to be familiar with our top 10 that's going to be up there. You know what I mean? We're going to have 10 artist songs already up there that's holding a position. You know what I mean? We had a socials, all they shit up there, right? And what, what I want to do is be able to ask the room, hey, y'all heard the record. What y'all think? Y'all want to put it up against something? And the room may collectively say, you know what? Shit, we want him to challenge song number seven. You know what I mean? Lil A Dollar. All right, fuck it. Spend Lil A Dollar shit. Yes. Boom, come back up. Now, what's happening is Lil A Dollar might have been on our show three weeks ago. He just holding the spot because it's, you know, that's what, the, that's what the people say, what the fans are saying. Now, at this point in time, Lil A Dollar just been reintroduced to a whole nother crowd on a whole nother segment. Now, this artist... His song is battling his. Based upon what y'all say and how it goes, Lil A Dollar may maintain or the new dude may bump A Dollar and he got that spot. Right? So we got to put that play together. I want to add that to it. Oh, yeah. You that's know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's dope. That's pretty dope. Much dope. Sound nice. Pretty yeah, much you know what I'm saying? Give them, For real. Give them a fan base. Pretty much. Yeah, you know, because like, because every time this shit pop up, people going to see that. They're going to see that right there. Like, Oh, that's the top ten right there. And you know, as they watching our pot, our, watching us do our thing, you know what niggas gonna do? They gonna go to their phone. They gonna check. Oh, who's this? Yeah, nigga? who's this? Follow, follow. I like that. Oh yeah. yeah, I fuck with that. Share, share, share. You know, my whole mission is to these fucking platforms, man. They getting real money, but the people that's coming up there, they already got money. They mainstream motherfuckers, they movie stars, they athletes. You know, so they just doing it you know, for their own marketing thing as far as them and the actual people who podcast it is, they making their money, you know, through the advertisement and shit that's, you know, flowing through there. But, you know, once the artists leave, it's over with. Nah, fuck that. I want to create something to where it's an instrument, it's one of the tools for artist development for independent artists. That's where dope. I keep a light on them. So when I shit come on, you guys on this platform, a lot of you guys are look at the same way. This is why I came up with the my virtual audience is going to be clubhouse rooms. You know what I'm saying? So it might be, hey, hey uh, Crows, we got we got a little E coming Wednesday. He go with socials, he go all this shit. Y'all create a table, y'all do your homework on it. Figure out everything about him. Check out what then went on with him. He had any beefs, where he come from, where any projects he dropped, any features he made. Get everything about it. Y'all figure out what y'all want to ask him. Me and we going to be in here doing our thing. We're going to always have one host in the virtual, on the virtual screen, which is somebody in that clubhouse room. Now, you got to understand what this is going to do for y'all. They going to see just what we looking at on this phone. So all you guys on here, people going to become familiar with you. They're going to become familiar with Clubhouse and they're going to be familiar with this room and following that greenhouse. Because the same way Rick resets on here, he's going to reset on that. Hey, yeah, all y'all zooming in right now, don't forget to boom, 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 click the greenhouse. Today we do, we're going to run it the same way. Right? Yeah, that's dope. Right? So now, you know, you guys going to be, people going to be introduced to you guys because I may look up and say, hey, T Rose. What's up, man? Uh, I know you got something in the in the back channel. What they talking about? Yeah, yeah, whack. But I do got quite a few questions. Well, shit, man, give me your top five. Okay, we got, you know, such and such from the goo. You know, we got Daryl, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Lulu or ECMD from the goo. They asking, boom, 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 and boom, 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 and boom, boom, boom. They're going to answer, right? Boom. Then me and Rick go back into our thing, doing our thing with them. Then I'm going to double back and do what we do best. Hey, let's open the room up. You know what I'm saying? Now the floor is open. That's where everybody on the floor come in at. Right? 
You know what I mean? So then we're going to debut his music. You know, I got a few that casted already and hit me. Beef and they want to fight. So I got some for all you niggas that want to fight. <laughs> got some for you niggas too. Y'all want to fight? Y'all coming in there? Nigga, you ain't bringing no weapons. You ain't bringing no bunch of niggas. We're going to sit down. We're going to talk about music first. Then we're going to talk about whatever the beef is. We're going to come up with a resolution to it. If we can come up to it a resolution and shake hands, cool. If y'all want to put the gloves on, which we do have a pair of gloves at the, at the studio, y'all can put the gloves on in a controlled situation. But the only way you can put the gloves on, if y'all agree that as soon as them gloves come off, y'all got to go in that studio and do a song together. Booyah! Yeah, I, I like that. Now, There's if y'all go in the studio fine. and do a song like together, that. if y'all do a, if y'all go in that studio and do a song together, then Wack gonna pick up the slack, and I'm gonna put a marketing budget behind the song. That's fire. So we gonna, Ooh. yeah, we okay, gonna change okay. the game. Win-win win situation. Win-win. Yeah, yeah, you know True. what I'm saying. Now True. everybody leave. Y'all ain't got the squabble out the way. We understand what niggas gonna do and not gonna do no more. And guess what? You niggas might get some notoriety together off a song, so hopefully y'all call each other, nigga. You ain't got to see each other, nigga. Send a nigga a verse, send a nigga a beat, y'all, and keep it moving. That's a real that shit. That is dope, guns. right? True, hey, hey, true, hey. true. Hey, guns, Game changer, hey, guns right? Guns down, guns down, gloves up. Guns down, gloves up. Straight Creep up. will be orchestrating the phase. I will be the referee. Yeah, and it's going to be, I was just saying, it's going to be control. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, hey, listen, it might be a motherfucker got the heart of a line. He just ain't got no hands, but he feel like I'm a man. Fuck it. So we ain't going to let a motherfucker get stomped out, dogged out, no type of shit. That ain't going to happen. You know what I'm saying? You know, we, we putting the shit to rest, you know, and then we're going to go. Listen, the nigga that lost the fight, see it like this. You couldn't beat the nigga in the gloves. Go fuck him up in that booth. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't no dissing mm. No Disney, mm, just nice. deliver your bars. You know what I'm saying? You know, nigga, I could get you in that glove, but I'm going to wear your ass out on these bars, and we're going to let the people, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, it, it, that's yeah. how now, I'm supposed to be on some sports shit. Now, at that point in time, that is maximum exposure for two people that a lot of motherfuckers didn't know who they was. Right. Hey, yo, this track, can I say something to you, Wack? Yeah, all day. Yo, big dog, like, I just feel like people need to give you more of your roses, bro, because you are a genius when it comes to this shit. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Just keep doing what you're doing. I want to shout out you. I want to shout out Troves Nation. Shout out my boy CEO, Rick and T. Rose. You know what I'm saying? Respect, big homie. Yeah, love. You know what I mean?